Hey, my famous fans, and boy, do we have a doozy for you today. Grab your popcorn because it looks like Benefit 2.0 is officially over, and it's not the Hollywood ending we were all hoping for. Ah, Benefit. The couple that had us all believing in second chances and rekindled romances. When Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck got back together in 2021, it was like the early 2000s all over again. Nostalgia hit hard, and for a brief moment, we all believed in true love. Their love story was like something out of a rom-com, except this one had a budget of $60 million for a mega mansion, private jets, and lavish vacations. And just when we thought the universe was making up for the original Benefer breakup, we find ourselves right back where we started. So worse. So what went wrong? Well, according to TMZ, Jennifer Lopez filed for divorce on Tuesday two years to the day after their lavish Georgia wedding. Ironic, isn't it? While some couples celebrate anniversaries with romantic getaways, Jennifer Lopez decided to gift herself freedom. And here's the kicker she filed pro per, which means she didn't even bother hiring a lawyer. Who needs legal fees when you can just DI your divorce, right? But let's rewind to April 26, 2024, the date Jennifer Lopez listed as their official separation. Seems like spring wasn't just bringing flowers this year, but also the end of yet another Hollywood marriage. And to add insult to injury, sources say the couple didn't even have a prenup. Talk about living on the edge, especially when you're sitting on a combined fortune that could buy a small country. The rumors of trouble started swirling as early as May 2024, when the couple reportedly began couples therapy. Couples therapy, in Hollywood, that's practically code for we're done, but we're just trying to figure out who gets the mansion and who gets the kids. Speaking of the mansion, Affleck was reportedly spotted moving out of their Beverly Hills home and into a house in Brentwood. Now, when your significant other decides to move 30 minutes away, you know things are bad. Oh, and let's not forget that infamous moment when Ben was seen without his wedding ring. Fans immediately started speculating and of course the gossip mills went into overdrive. Because if a celebrity isn't wearing their wedding ring, it's basically a neon sign flashing divorce incoming. They hadn't been seen together in public for over a month and a half a lifetime in celebrity years. Meanwhile, Jennifer Lopez was gallivanting around Europe on a solo vacation, taking in the sights of Italy and enjoying a luxury yacht. Because really what better way to drown your sorrows than by living your best life on the Mediterranean. But Affleck, he stayed in Los Angeles house hunting. Maybe he was looking for a new bachelor pad or perhaps just a place to escape the fever dream that was his marriage. Affleck didn't argue, which tells us he was probably already packing his bags. By the time summer hit, it was crystal clear that Benefer 2.0 was no more. Lopez spent her time in New York, attending the premieres of her film Atlas Solo, while Ben stayed put in Los Angeles. The only thing they were sharing at that point was their mutual understanding that this marriage was not going to work. And in true Jennifer Lopez fashion, she made sure to keep the spotlight on her. The singer, actress, and all-around Queen Bee strutted the red carpet at the Met Gala solo, even though she was one of its co-chairs. Affleck, on the other hand, let her handle the Los Angeles and Mexico premieres of Atlas alone. Talk about a disappearing act. So what's next for our star-crossed lovers? Well, Jennifer Lopez has already made it clear that she's moving on and fast. She's waived any claims to spousal support and is making sure Affleck doesn't get a dime either. It's almost like she's saying, thanks for the memories, but I've got better things to do. And with her 16-year-old twins Max and Emmy to think about, she's probably not wasting any time dwelling on the past. Affleck, meanwhile, will likely retreat to his Brentwood hideout, lick his wounds and figure out his next move. Maybe he'll dive into another project. Or perhaps he'll just take some time to reflect on why Benifer 2.0 didn't pan out the way he hoped. So there you have it, famous fans the fairy tale that wasn't. Benifer 2.0 is officially over, and while we may be sad to see this chapter close, we can't say we're entirely surprised. After all, Hollywood marriages are like fireworks, they shine bright, make a big splash, and then fizzle out just as quickly. But don't worry, there's always another drama waiting in the wings, and you can bet we'll be here to spill all the tea. Make sure to give that like button some love, hit subscribe and ring the bell for all the latest updates. You're tuned in to Famous Faces Scoop TV, where there's never a dull moment.